What's up guys, this is Joe Keen Johns 84 and I'm not here to show you my P90 class. For sure you guys have been asking like this since forever because you always see me running around with the P90 and rushing the hell out of each stage and uh, for sure you're asking yourself like how do you do it, what do you use and uh, you know I'm here to answer those questions guys and here it is, here's my two classes right here, the Sneaky Bastard and the P90 Rebel. Uh, the only difference is, is just the kill streaks. that's about it. The, the Sneaky Bastard I've been using it since uh, after the week of, after like a week after after the release of 1043, I've uh, been using it till May, and then after May, I decided to use the assault kill streaks. And uh, I've been doing a lot better with the assault kill streaks than the, with the support kill streaks. You know, I, I remember I, I, when I used to use the support kill streaks a lot, I would always be using that EMP, stealth bombers, and uh, the UAV. I mean, I'm rank like uh, calling in airstrikes like around 900, and I'm that's crazy, man. I've been calling on like too many airstrikes and <laughs> with a stealth bomber, it counts as an airstrike, so yeah, I have that accolade and uh, I'm ranked like around. 900 it's pretty crazy guys yeah I, I called in too many stealth bombers I mean I, when I was getting back at like a like 40 kills per game I mean I, I'm always getting that stealth bomber man it's, it was pretty crazy it was pretty crazy so yeah guys uh, today I'm just gonna explain to you guys what the class that I'm using that which is the P90s and uh, it's just uh, I'm gonna show you like what what things do I put on it and um, Hopefully you guys enjoy it. So yeah, let's get it started, guys. Um, here it is, the P90 Rebel. They're both the same, so I'm just gonna explain it like for both of them. As you can see here, we got the P90, and I put in the attachments range and the silencer. Let's just check it out. P90, the range attachment and the silencer attachment. The reason I have range is because it will cancel out the silencer because. If you're just gonna leave the silencer on, uh, it will lower the damage of the P90, and it will lower the range almost because uh, the damn silencer it affects a lot of the P90. And if you just leave it like that without the range, the P90 will suck literally, and uh, you don't want that, guys. It will make the P90 look like it was just a goddamn toy, or just shooting wooden bullets. You don't want that. So yeah, it is important to attach the range on it because it will make the P90 stronger. And the backup weapon, we got the MP9 with a silencer. The MP9 is a pretty great weapon single. And uh, it's a lot better than the Kimbo. And uh, it will take on anybody like face to face. It's like having an uh, extra backup primary weapon, man. The MP9 is like a... I think this gun's supposed to be a primary weapon somehow. Because uh, this gun actually can take out like a lot of people. And uh, it acts like it was a, some kind of primary. So yeah, the MP9 is a pretty good weapon to have as a backup. It's a lot better than M FMG 9s, believe me it is a lot better it's a lot better than scorpion totally and it's a lot better than any other machine pistols out there it's better than the g18 yeah the mp9 is the best gun to use as a single weapon do not use it as a kimbo because a kimbo it'll literally like make it inaccurate and it doesn't have that much of a power to attack with so yeah and the fmg 9s i remember i used to use them but i don't use them no more because i don't know the this gun has been toned down also on the uh, kimbo side and because it was requested by so many modern warfare 3 players so yeah do not use the fmg 9s the kimbos try to use the mp9 single and you'll be feeling like it was just a, a, an extra primary weapon so yeah uh, the ether, we got the Samtex and the portable radar at ta as tactical. The perks are Sledgeham Pro, Assassin Pro, Stalker Pro. Now, the reason I have this is because I'm the, I'm one of those rushes of Modern Warfare 3 that loves to get out there in the field, that loves to get dirty, that wants to get those flags, that wants to get those kills first. You know, I'm a rusher, guys. That's what I'm labeled at. And uh, you've seen it in my videos. You know, I'm always running around around the map and I'm getting a lot of kills. This is what I use, guys. Sledgeham Pro because you know once you kill somebody, you need to uh, reload as fast as possible and there's another guy coming in the back hand behind them if you don't have slide hand pro you can have missiles kills so yeah it is important to have slide hand pro because you know once you kill somebody and there's another guy behind them you gotta kill them as fast as you can because you know they're gonna kill you be instead if you don't kill them uh, that's, and then we got Assassin Pro, you know, you're invisible on the radar, you're never going to be detected at all. And it's important to get Assassin Pro as fast as possible because once you get Assassin Pro, you're going to be like a ninja. You're not going to be detectable at all. Next, we got the Stalker Pro. The Stalker Pro is very, almost very important, guys. You know, once you move, you keep moving forward, you can add, like, extra damage to your opponent because um, the bullets will get there a lot faster. And that's how I get a lot of kills, like, like the fastest. People call me Hacker. I don't know why. And um, and this, this is probably it because of the damn Stalker Pro because um, you're going to be moving a lot faster forward and they're going to they're gonna die a lot, a lot quicker it's like you're just killing them with just two bullets that's about it and that's what's awesome about stalker pro and then it acts and then it adds like um, the delay detections trigger the explosions 
I mean, you can walk literally over mines and literally over claymores, and you're not going to get exploded at all. So it's pretty awesome to have Stalker Pro. And then next is just the strike package, as you can see here. It's just the Predator missiles and the Reapers, the Reapers and the AC-130. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I'm just talking about the P90 classes because so many people keep asking me. And uh, here's your answer, guys. This is my class right here. This is the class that I've been rushing with like, for the longest time. Hopefully you guys like the video. Hopefully you guys come back for more. Comment the video. Tell me what you think about these two classes. And um, yeah, leave a like and leave a comment. I'll see you guys later. Enjoy your day.